Someday I hope there is some platform for capturing some of these dreams and turning them into reality. could use the underground to have more houses and more underground space. I think that would happen someday for sure. But right now I think there are a lot of other things that can be put below ground. And one of the things that people are actively now considering going underground is manufacturing facilities. We have actually already studied quite a lot of uh, underground usage of facilities from pure farming underground to storing oil underground. Now, the challenge comes when we start to bring more people to go underground and live there because the extended period of a person staying underground may have psychological effect. I am claustrophobic, so I think from my own personal perspective, I think having that sun, being able to see outside does help. But I'm sure there are not many people like me. There are people who, who are not claustrophobic. Swimming complex. And like, okay. since it takes up a lot of space, we can put the swimming pools on top of the HDBs. Yeah, no, absolutely. I think that's a great idea. And not only it saves space, I think it would be a spectacular amenity in the building. Well, the only thing you've got to be careful with is a lightning strike. Because you are now at a higher location. Singapore, it has some of the most uh, lightning strikes in the world. Of course, you can build a higher lightning rod. Otherwise, basically cover it up so we don't have an open concept. We can like buy land from other countries. And if we don't have enough money, we can just take it illegally. And then you like put it in maybe like a big, big plane or a storage ship. And we should ship it off to Singapore and plop it down in okay. Singapore. That's a good one. I would say it's the most creative idea. I would just love that someday you can buy land from another country, put it in the plane and bring it over. I'll be careful of doing it illegally though. Uh, if you can do that, I think we can. there are a lot of countries who would want to sell land to us. Geology-wise, it's not possible to cut out land like a piece of cake. But uh, buying land in a foreign country and then uh, going there to build your settlement and so forth, Yes, you can. I've heard that uh, even countries like uh, Maldives, they are actually already thinking of that because the, the country is sinking due to global warming. I would say the most innovative idea is the last one. If we can trade land between the countries, I think that would be a very interesting concept. I may have to start thinking about how the world would be if that really happens. Underground space? <laughs> Uh, because uh, I do underground space as well. So I like underground space and I believe in that. Dreams are the start point, starting point of reality. I think if people don't dream, I don't think great things would have ever been discovered. Don't let anything restrict what you can dream. Yeah.